Good morning. I'm say good morning, mops. This is a problem when other creators meet up and then they show you their cool gear, so. <laughs> I have my hair clips in still, because I'm. I think with curly hair, you're supposed to set it the way you want it to stay or whatever. Um, but yeah, so good morning, guys. Vlogmas day. I don't know what's today. 16. Um, Vlogmas day 16. So um, I twerked my knee, like I said the other day, and it's actually like 80, 90% better. So I have my knee brace on and stuff, and I was like looking at all my bills and like thinking about all the stuff I have to do and I'm like god I hope they offer a shift and they offered a shift so I took the extra shift for tonight so I'll be working four days in a row um I just need to uh make sure everything's in order um so I was cleaning the house like I guess the people that rent us our house are gonna be selling it soon so they want to do like a walkthrough and stuff but I'm not sure like what actually needs to happen with that so I've just been like trying to clean up and like make sure everything looks nice and stuff um, but I don't know when that's supposed to be um, and then what else just like making sure like everything's set up and ready for whatever um, and then I'm going to do Advents here in a second by myself because every time Aaron tells me he's going to do them, he, like, weasels his way out. Last night we just did our hair like we did, um, well, I did his hair. Like, he got his hair cut and then I dyed it black and stuff. But then I was so tired after. Excuse me, I didn't do anything. I just fell asleep. And then I woke up, like, at 3 a.m. and, like, found my grade. So, oh, my God. My grade I got on my final paper was, like, an 89 and they said there was some grammar things, which I know. But then um, my grade went down from a 93 to a 90.83 or something. So I'm still got an A. <laughs> so I'm really excited because that was a hard class. Like that class was hard. It wasn't like the work or anything. It was the workload. So it was like the work was okay. It was adequately hard or whatever. But it was just a lot of like busy work and a lot of work, 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 work. So... I'm glad that that class is over. Um, and now that I don't have school, I'm going to try to pick up as many shifts as I can at work just so I can supplement my credit cards and help pay them off. And like, there's so many things we're supposed to be doing and like figuring out if we're going to stay here, if we're going to move or like what's going to happen. Like there's just so many different things that could happen. So I'm just trying to make sure I have enough money to push us along. You know what I mean? Anyway, um... Yeah, and then I did my tuition reimbursement last night, and they said it's not going to be reimbursed until January 20th. And my class is, like, January 19th or something, so it's going to be reimbursed, like, late. And I was like, oh, fluff, so I just got to keep everyone involved so that that doesn't happen, like, in a bad way. Um, but at least they're reimbursing me, like I said... They pay 100%, well, almost 100% for school, so that's really nice, but it's because I go to UNM. Um, I don't know, I guess I'm glad I slept in really, really late today so I could work tonight. Um, what else happened? Um, everybody loves mops, and I don't know. I don't know what else happened. What happened yesterday? We still needed to get groceries and stuff, but that didn't happen because of the time that we woke up we just needed to rest i think this is why i work weekends is so like we don't get so overwhelmed because like we feel like we never go anywhere so when we do we like overdo it and go everywhere so we'll see about my schedule and see what i have to do <sighs> excuse me i used to work tuesday wednesday thursday so i could pick up a weekend shift because people call in on the weekends a lot apparently um but then that never happened. That doesn't happen at this job. Because I have to work a weekend day. And then we're all like on the same weekend day. And then we have to float. It's like. It's like. So you're supposed to think big picture sometimes. But I don't think everybody thinks big picture. And I just think it's like. Oversight or like ignorance. I don't know. So what's today? The 16th. So it would be. Marissa, Anissa, Lisa, and Josh. Hopefully Lisa called in sick. Or I don't know. Maybe Anissa called in sick. Whatever. As long as I'm not answering everyone else's call lights and 
providing patient care to patients that aren't mine because my patients need my help, then I'll be okay. Let me actually ask who the nurse is tonight before I pick up a shift. Or actually, it doesn't matter because I've actually been becoming a Hellcat at work and I think people understand that now. <laughs> yes, Mops. Yes, my little angel. Come here, girl. Come here. Come here, goblin. She's like, pay attention to me. So I turn towards her as she runs away. Oh, come here. Ugh. Oh, Mops, be careful. I love you, little gremlin. Look at how cute she is. Look at her weird little face. It's so cute. She's so weird looking. I made her a dress last night. Like a little, um, I don't know what they're called. Like a mandarin dress. Ugh, it's so cute. It took me like 30 minutes to make it because I kept having to re-measure her chest. But it's so cute. It has little arm cutouts and it looks so classy. Because her other little dress was so slutty. Like it was like way higher than it should have been. When we got it, it was the perfect size. And then because she's growing, it got bigger. Oh my little angel. Plus, I think we have to pay for her surgery. And then get reimbursed through her like dog insurance place or whatever. But that's a good idea. That's a good thing. Maybe I should write that down. So I was going to te teach you. <laughs> I was going to show you guys about my planning stuff. So mops. Shots. Cost. Plus reimbursement. So like my planning thing, my planning situation. So I watched a few of the YouTube things because I felt like I wasn't getting the most out of this. And Aaron got this cover for me because I was really into it. Um, but I want to make sure I'm doing everything right. So one of the things they say is like whenever you're like trying to be a planner and stuff to write everything down. And I usually do that. Like I legit have like a thousand like post-its everywhere. But they said those are supposed to get put into your dashboard and then you have to put them into your thing every day. So I've been getting a lot better at it, but it's like, I'm not professional, but I'm not the worst. So it's just really, really helped me though. Hi. Hi. Hi, Gremlin. Hi, Gremlin. So I'll finish cleaning downstairs. I'm listening to Harry Potter right now. I downloaded Bless Me Ultima. I downloaded Dune. I downloaded uh, The Similarian. I downloaded The Hobbit. So I, Audio Audible is just like li making me live right now. Like I am living my best life. Um... I'm going to finish cleaning downstairs. I really want Aaron to do our advents together with us. Because Mops has one too now. Okay, maybe I'll just do those. Hold on. Hi. So we're going to do our advents. Ah, never by yourself if you have a dog. <laughs> so we'll do this one first. It's the bath bomb. We'll do all four. Because we're like way behind on these. So it looks like they're all pink. <laughs> so it's the jasmine and sparkling cranberry. So these are the sparkling cranberry and this one's the jasmine. Don't eat these mops. So this one was actually a really fun one. Fun to take baths. Um, the next one we'll do is the Lint Advent Calendar. And it's what? The 16th? So we'll go 5... Where is six? Hi, buddy. I don't know. I don't see six. Six? No mops. No mops. Oh, six is empty. <laughs> seven? Where's seven? Chill mops. Seven is this bear. Okay, done. Eight. Oh God, there's like, you have to like look for these. Look at, like you legit, you have to like look for the numbers and the stars. Eight is here, it's done. Nine, nine is up here, nine wasn't done. Ooh, it's a green one, it's a green candy. No! Jesus, so Mop's been getting put in her kennel a lot lately because we can't supervise her and she's been getting into chocolate and candy excuse me and pieces of plastic that she throws up so for safety we've been putting her in her kennel um 10 
Where's Tan? Tan is these little birds, big nosy in Santa's house, like Aaron said. It's a little bear. Eleven. Chill, Mops. Chill. Eleven is this one over here. <laughs> Balls. Don't worry, Mops. Yours is next. Twelve. Let's see, twelve. Twelve. Is this little bear. It's another green one. Yummy. Thirteen. Thirteen is up here. It's a little squirrel. Ooh, it looks like a butter. These look like butter palette pats. Pats. Fourteen. Where's fourteen? Fourteen is down here. It's a red one. It's a red one. Fifteen. Uh, Fifteen is some snow. Let's see what's in here. Ah, ah. It's another little bear and some pajamas. Do you guys remember bananas and pajamas? Oh, wow. They're almost all open. <laughs> Okay, so we'll leave this one over here because it's done. I'm going to open this one for M.O.P.S. So this is the one Erin got for her the other night at PetSmart. Petco. I thought it was saying some warnings. Oh, I was just saying ingredients. Ingredients. Mops, are you excited? So it says the 25 treats of Christmas. Oh, and these are all in a row, so that's nice. Are you excited, buddy? Okay, so number one, we're just going to play catch up. Oh, there's Christmas trees. You want one, Mop? You want one? She's so excited. She's all... <laughs> okay, so... Eat it. Oh, she doesn't like it. She spit it out. So her teeth all fell out, and now she's got, like, baby baby puppy teeth again. So now she's having a hard time chewing. Okay, so two. Two is empty. Oh, I think they all just fell out. Cause it's like a little tray with these on the bottom. Because 11 feels hefty. Three. Empty. I think they just fell. Four is empty. <laughs> oh, no. Five is empty. Ten is empty. Nine is empty. Eight has something. Finally, look at, they're all like empty. But it's because the way it was made. And it's my fault. Because we were being really, I was being really sloppy with this. Ooh, it has two and, oh no, one. Seven has one. Woo woo. Woo woo. So seven has one. And it looks like more Christmas trees and a star. Oh, I lost it. There it is. Okay, so look at the little star. This is super cute. And then the little tree. Still like gnarring on it. Oh, oh, and there's a little bone. How cute. What does six have? A little tree. Did you eat it? Did you eat it? That's a baby. Come on. Come up, 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 up. How cute is this? This is the cutest thing. 11 has something, 12 has something, 13. Okay, so I'm going to do like a little less than half, so I'm going to stop at 10, and then we'll keep going the rest of the thing, um, because like I said, some of them are empty. So that was kind of cool. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 treats out of this out of 10 days, so that's pretty chill. Um, and then the last one we'll have to do is going to be the wine one. The wine advent. I've been drinking a lot lately. Lately, I need to slow down. I don't really drink that much. Like I like to drink, but I don't drink that much. And I feel like I've been drinking a lot lately. But I don't like that because my body gets tired. Because I'm old. Ugh. Okay, so we'll do this one. Mm. Okay, so eight is done. Two, five, seven. Oh my gosh, we're behind. A lot. Nine is a white wine. Merry Christmas. 
Ooh, Savion Blanc. That one was actually really good the other day. So here, Marcus, hold on to that for me. Uh, 10 is a red wine. Gaga. <laughs> Ooh, Cote du Rhone. I've never actually had that one. Have you guys had this? Is it delicious? It looks cool. Do 11 is also a red one. 11 says Chardonnay. I like a Chardonnay. It's kind of like bittery, or not bitter, like tangy, I guess. Let's see, 12. On the 12th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me wine. <gasps> a Champagne? Is it a Champagne? It's red, but it's a Champagne. Blanc de Blancs. Brut sparkling wine. Cute. Oh, it's all bubbly. Look at the little top on it. How cute. Oh, I like this one. It's for, like, celebration. What do you think? <clears throat> you ready for another treat? You ready for another treat? Do you want another treat? You're so cute. Okay. 12. On the 13th day of Christmas, my true love gave to me a white wine. Oh, my God. Nobody needs to hear this. Oh, these are all different colors now. They're supposed to be the color of the little thing, but these are not. This one's a Merlot. Like I said, I used to love Merlot when I was a child. Um, 14, where's 14, 14, 14? Boom. Yeah. This one is oh, a rosé. Yeah, all day rosé, all day, all day rosé. Oh, yummy. It looks pretty. Sometimes rosé gives me headaches. Certain ones, I don't know why. 15. Mm. 15 says another Chardonnay. So these are cute. Like you could legit, Aaron was telling me we could put them out and do like a wine tasting. Cause I think we're going to have a new year's party at one of my friend's houses. So I'll help him set everything up and stuff like that. So he's not all alone. And then we'll stop at 16. Ah. Yes, honey. Yes, honey, bitch. Yes, honey. Come through. Uh, Cabernet Sauvignon. Yummy. So that's yummy. I like that. That makes me really happy. So we caught up, guys, on our advent calendars. We had like a week's worth of stuff to do. I really wanted to do it with Aaron, but he doesn't like to be on camera. So we'll see. Um, I'm going to work tonight, like I said, to do all of the work stuff and make, make money, honey. But we'll see. I think Aaron wanted to do like a random photo shoot because he just got his hair done. So he's probably going to be mad at me, but I need to make money more than I need to be taking pictures of people that don't pay me to take pictures of them. I don't make that money, honey. Someone wants lips for Christmas, I'm going to get them lips for Christmas. If he doesn't watch my videos, this is going to get washed over. But I think I'll get him some lips, because he likes his lips. And maybe a sprinkle of Botox. We'll see what he gets for Christmas. Probably something cute, though. Because I love him. He's my best friend. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to tune in for next time and see what shenanigans I get in. Hopefully my leg's feeling a lot better from when I twisted it or whatever. So hopefully I can be able to do something cool. Go around, maybe we'll do River of Lights on Friday. Friday night, that'd be kind of cute. If you guys don't know, I know it's like bigger in San Antonio and stuff, but we have like our version here and it's pretty cute. It got like national recognition last year, so. Oh, and I still have my clips in. <laughs> It's so that my hair sets the way I want them to. Because if you have curly hair and you don't set it when you're trying to curl it, it's just going to look like Medusa. So thanks so much for watching again, guys. Have a great holiday season, and I'll talk to you again later. Bye! <laughs>